my mind. Put a finger down if your new neighbors that just moved in upstairs won't stop having loud sex five times a day. So you decided that you would go upstairs and politely ask them to quiet down. But then an elderly couple answered the door and you didn't have the heart to tell them to quit being loud. So now you're sitting in your room trying not to listen to them. <gasps> Actually, listen, it's kind of a beat though. Oh my gosh. Today I'm gonna be showing you how to make a really good coffee. First off, I take Okay, ignore that sound. My neighbors have a lot of sex. So first I take my ice and I pour my coffee into it. Next, milk froth. Dude, they're so loud. Okay, now I take my milk frother and my milk. Let's blend a little bit of this. Lid. Okay, now we wait for it to froth. Okay, now stuff. I go like this. I do it high so I can. Oh gosh, oops. A little bit of a mix. Just like that. And voila! This is how I make my coffee. Okay, so to be honest, I am normally not like this. I think that this time it's an exception. So I live on a farm. Unfortunately, one of our cows were supposed to be butchered today. The guy was supposed to come pick her cow up and take her off. Do you have any idea what this man did? Instead of taking our cow to some butcher house, this guy killed the cow in front of all the other cows. We have never had someone do that. And to make matters worse, this guy for some reason thought to leave the head of the cow on our property. So my parents don't get home till four. My siblings siblings get off the bus around 3.30. So guess what my siblings came home to? I I'll give you a second, guess. Yep. uh-huh. Oh, hey, <laughs> didn't see you there. You guys should eat lunch with me. Featuring Duncan. I have not been feeling myself and I haven't been for the past couple of days, but freaking dang it. I've just been insecure about myself. My skin had a breakout. It's covered by makeup. I was bloated. Ah, oh, frick, they burnt my bagel. Oh, it's so burnt. It's fine. I'm fine. Recently, I just wanted to hide my face from social media. But then I got to thinking, I shouldn't just present myself only when I feel good. This burnt bagel slaps. And I shouldn't just present myself when I look my best. Because that's deceiving and exhausting. So truth is, I have felt like crap recently. And I figured I would just tell you how I felt. And I figured that we should eat together. And if you need some encouragement, because life freaking sucks sometimes, feel free to DM me on Instagram. Let's share some positivity with each other. Bye! I love you! Have a good- Ah! Bye, I love you, have a good day. So a while back, my friends decided to play a game during quarantine and sleep with a guy beginning with each letter of the alphabet. I mean, that's why their parents are paying for them to go to college, for that intelligence. Anyways, after sleeping her way through until letter K, one of them found out she was pregnant with triplets. And now she's been playing the process of elimination to figure out who the dad is. She started to freak out because she thought that there may be multiple dads to her three children. She finally got a second test done. And I am happy to inform you, out of the 11 guys she slept with, that only one is the father. So Ethan from Arkansas State University, <laughs> congratulations! You're a father, champ! Suddenly Saturdays aren't for the boys. <laughs> They're for the babysitting. But we're all praying for you. Good luck. Blake, are you ready to meet my boyfriend? Depends if you're ready to meet my girlfriend. Your girlfriend? Yeah. You don't have a girlfriend. If you can get a boyfriend, I can get a girlfriend. Easy. Oh yeah? Who's your girlfriend? Dixie. The amount of sass. <laughs> Dixie D'Amelio? Yeah, don't question us. I had no idea my brother was dating Dixie D'Amelio. Yeah, it's about to be Dixie Swata. Okay, is that right? Yeah, we're going out to dinner tonight. Tonight? <laughs> tonight? <sighs> Have you ever just been like so stressed out that like it literally feels like a... It literally just feels like 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 bricks are on your chest, you know what I'm saying? Like it's like everything in this entire world is just going against you and you just want one second to just chill out. Or maybe I just I just want to go to like the top of a mountain and just scream. I just want to scream so loud that my my problems are just shaking and quivering and they just get so scared that they just go away. You know what I'm saying? Like like does my parents stress me out? Like school stresses me out. Wait, I dropped out of college. My job stresses me out. Just literally everything just stresses me out. I just want to, I just literally just want to cry. But I'm not going to because I'm not going to show my problems that I'm scared. No, my problems are what's going to be scared. You know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do?
is what I'm gonna do. I don't know. Oh my gosh! I just made a post on Instagram. If you have any problems, just go vent in the comments. Let's just go vent together. Who wears the pants? Who made the first move? Who's a better kisser? Who's smarter? Who works harder? Who's always right? Who's gonna make more money? Who wants to get married first? Who's funnier? Who wants more kids? Who wears the pants? Who needs the most attention? Who's more likely to get away with murder? Who's most, most athletic? Who buys better gifts? Who texts first in the morning? Who's more attractive? <laughs> Who's the most adventurous? Who's hornier? <laughs> <laughs> Who's more outgoing? Who's most likely to become TikTok famous? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna be sick. I was already having a bad day. Just when I thought it couldn't get any worse, I just watched a grown woman pull down her mask, pick her nose, and look at it as if it was going to start talking to her. Apparently she didn't like what it was saying because then she flicked it. It didn't come off. So she wiped it on the back of the man that was standing in front of her. I was gonna say something, but to my surprise, he turned around and grabbed a handful of her booty. I don't even want to think, like, are they married? Dude, should I have said something? Tell me when you're married, that stuff doesn't happen. If that stuff just casually happens when you're married, I don't want it. I hate Walmart. <laughs> they are done. So I have some college sorority friends. They all decided that they would challenge each other and see who could sleep their way through the alphabet first. As in hook up with a guy beginning with each letter of the alphabet i mean seriously what could go wrong they just started this challenge two months ago one of the ladies already made it to letter k last night and then found out today that she is pregnant with a child bun in the oven <laughs> and not with one not with two but with three babies well someone was fertile and she doesn't know who the dad is it could be alex ben caleb darren or the other six guys but on the bright side she hooked up with letter k last night therefore kevin from arkansas state university you are not a father champ congratulations bro as for the rest of the letters it's a guessing game who's about to be a dad of three today i decided i'd pick on my sister <laughs> Hi. Hey. I have to tell you something. Why do you have breast vitamins? I have to tell you something. Madeline. What? You're adopted. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Mom and dad didn't tell you, but that's literally why you don't look like any of us. Moment of realization. Sorry if that hurt your feelings. I was just being honest. Oh, we're being honest now? Fine. Mom said the other day you were an accident. Sometimes the truth hurts. So today I went to go get my ears pierced, and the lady was literally taking 25. What? Go. No, go. And the lady was literally taking 20. Go. And the lady was literally taking 25 minutes. I'm trying to tell a story. <coughs> the lady was literally taking 25 minutes to make two little dots. I had a lunch at once, so I politely said, hey, if it's gonna take much longer, I'll just come back later. She got frustrated with me and said, Ma'am, it's not my fault that your ears are so uneven. I didn't even know my ears were uneven. Let me just add that to the list of insecurities I didn't know I need to have. Right next to the fact that I ain't never seen two pretty best friends. So I couldn't find the match to any of my socks. Today we are doing some deep cleaning. So I go downstairs and all my socks are underneath my brother's bed. Apparently they've been down there for so long they've aged. Like literally, they've been down there for that long. Hey guys, how's it going? It has been a minute. I've just been taking a break. You know how it is, mental health. Gotta find happiness in here. Thank you, Jesus. I'm about to hop on that trend. Literally everyone is trying that Starbucks drink. The Venti Iced White Mocha with sweet cream and extra caramel drizzle. Fine for you. Hi, can I get the Venti Iced White Mocha with sweet cream and extra caramel drizzle? Of course, what else you for you? That will be all. I'm going to be 776 for the window. Thank you. Dude, it's $8? Man, it better be good. I have very high expectations for this. Moment of truth. Oh, that is good. Best day of my life. Oh. Hey, Dad. Hey, Dad. I'm making a video. Hey, uh, your dog just got hit by a car. You okay? Okay. You need to come home. And can you pick up some milk on the way? <laughs> Literally worst day of my life. So we've had this on our chest for eight years now. Our parents got a divorce and our dad started dating other women. Out of all the things
fish in the sea. Our dad meets Corella Deville, Maleficent, the evil queen, Ursula, aka the evil stepmom. Our dad thought he fell in love. I think she cast a spell on him. We never wanted to go to my dad's because we were so afraid of this woman. I thought she turned my puppy into a fur coat. One day we got tired of the Wicked Witch of the West, so we decided to get rid of her. When our dad was at work, we went into the bedroom and we threw a bucket of water on her in hopes that she would be vaporized. Like a witch. Uh, yeah. So, so she didn't turn into vapor. And we got grounded. We got grounded. Thankfully, she got caught cheating a couple of months later. You can't see that part. Oh, sorry. So today my sister is going on a second date. You look cute. And you look tired. I'm not tired, I'm just ugly. Thanks for your concern. My friends irritate me. Every time my friend and her boyfriend get in a fight, like three times a week, she makes a post on Instagram and says, I'm single. Like, I literally got in a fight last night with my parents. You don't see me getting on Instagram posting orphan after my parents and I get in an argument. Tabitha? What? Honestly, I bet our parents would get rid of you if they could. Get out. Get back in the car. No, you told me to get out. You're being stubborn and you're adopted. Was that even necessary? So I knew this girl back in high school. She hated me because she had a crush on my cousin and was jealous because we were always hanging out together at family events like Christmas, Thanksgiving. She was even jealous when our grandpa died and we went to the same funeral. Anyways, recently she reached out to me on Instagram. She said, hey girl, I'm a hairstylist now. I would love to do your hair for free. So today I'm going to get my hair done by my arch nemesis. Hello, how are you today? Hi, it's Zoe Laverne here. I'm the TikTok queen. I'm sure you know me. I mean, that was until Charlie D'Amelio came along and then she took it, you know, renegade, renegade. Anyways, I was wondering if I could get the venti ice white mocha with sweet cream and extra consent. Sorry, I keep getting the word consent and caramel mixed up. It's okay. Oh my gosh, thank you. No, you and I seem like we would be friends. How old are you? Oh my gosh, I'm 42. 42. Um, actually, you don't make my cutoff. Maybe you have like a younger brother, maybe like 13. So I just posted my new YouTube. Is my boyfriend? Is he crying? Matthew. Are you crying? My dog just died. Your dog just died? Are you serious? Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah. Are you recording? Yeah. <laughs> I was doing it for YouTube. Sorry, I ruined it. You didn't. You didn't ruin it. It's okay. It's okay. I'll help. Hey guys, <laughs> go watch a new YouTube video. It's about how she went on a road trip and doesn't have any friends. But I mean, in the mean way. But it's true. You really don't have friends. I'm your friend though. Thanks. I really didn't mean it to sound mean. I'm just sad. But go look at her video. It's in the bio. Okay, Matthew's currently taking a shower with sad music. Yeah, go spam his Instagram with love. Okay, hope you guys have a nice night. Literally, why am I so embarrassing? My boyfriend and I were talking, and a Shawn Mendes song was playing, and it's making me feel all in love. That's such a romantic vibe. Or so I thought. So I had a few things going through my mind. My boyfriend says, I want to tell you something. I was like, I want to tell you something too. So we tell each other at the same time. I said, I want to marry you. My boyfriend says, I'm gay for Shawn Mendes. Hey, oh, and he was like, oh, that that was horrible timing. <laughs> so there's that.